The ongoing battle between the NDA government and UPA appointed governors in the states has uh, now reached Kerala, where Sheila Dixit, the governor, says she will not resign on a phone call from the union home secretary. This is according to sources who are close to the former Delhi chief minister. They say that she cannot be forced out without a properly reasoned order that, uh, that uh, demands her removal. Sheila Dixit uh, ha has reportedly cited the 2010 Supreme Court judgment, which says governors cannot be arbitrarily removed from office just because a center, uh, the government at the center has changed. Ashar Khan joins us for more on this. Uh, Ashar, Sheila Dixit uh, is uh, among those seven governors who the NDA is trying to uh, get rid of, uh, presumably because they have extended terms in front of them. Uh, but uh, she says, uh, unless there's a properly reasoned argument, she's not going. Well, uh, let me put the record absolutely straight. The information which we got is from sources who are close to uh, the governor of Kerala, Sheila Dixit. Sheila Dixit nowhere has said this. These are, uh, but uh, what sources are telling us is that till the time a reasoned order from the MHA is not given, which is uh, in co in uh, construence with uh, what the Supreme Court judgment of 2010 was, Sheila Dixit will not put in her papers. She will not resign. Yes, there have been calls which have been made by. Uh, the union home secretary to several governors including that uh, to the Kerala governor uh, but what uh, the Kerala governor feels is that uh, this specific issue is not enough as per the Supreme Court judgment. The Supreme Court judgment categorically states that uh, there needs to be certain reasons in uh, under which the governors can be removed. A file has to be prepared. There has to be a reasoned order uh, which uh, should be given and which perhaps can also uh, be challenged in the court of law. So what we are hearing is that at best which the central government will do is will uh, transfer uh, Sheila Dixit from Kerala to a smaller state. Uh, this will be uh, a slight uh, which would be there on the face of uh, the Kerala governor. But on the other hand, the Kerala governor has uh, categorically uh, made up her mind that she will not uh, resign like uh, some of the other governors who have resigned uh, because of uh, the pressure from the current uh, central government. All right, Ashar, do stay with us uh, because we're getting more information about this ongoing battle between the center and UPA-appointed governors.